there was once a respected Jewish leader named Jairus. Now, he and his wife had a daughter. She was 12 years old, but she got very sick. Uh, so sick, in fact, that she was near to death. But Jairus heard that there was a miracle worker in the area named Jesus. So he went to find him. And he found Jesus at the edge of a lake. Jesus and his apprentices were getting out of a boat. And there was a crowd of people there who all wanted Jesus. But Jairus went up to Jesus and he fell down on his knees and he said, Jesus, my daughter is nearly dying. Please come and heal her. Well, Jesus went with Jairus. And the crowds went along with them and they were pressing in around. And on the way, Jesus suddenly stopped. And he turned around to the crowds and he said, Who touched my clothes? Now, one of Jesus' apprentices, Peter, said, How can you say, Who touched me in a crowd like this that's pressing in around us? But Jesus said, No, I felt some healing power go out from me. Who touched me? Well, a woman who was obviously frightened fell down at Jesus' feet and said, Oh, Jesus, for 12 years I've been bleeding. I've spent all my money on doctors and nothing has helped. In fact, it's got worse. But I thought, if only I could touch your clothes, that would be enough for me. And I touched your clothes and now I'm healed. Jesus said to her, oh, Daughter, because you trusted me, you're healed. Now get up and go in peace. Now Jairus was standing there waiting for Jesus to come and heal his daughter. But while Jesus was still talking to the woman, some messengers came from Jairus' house and said, No need to bother the teacher anymore. Your daughter is dead. Well, Jesus turned to Jairus and said, Don't be afraid. Just trust me. Then he sent all the crowds away except for three of his closest apprentices. And Jesus and those three followed Jairus towards his house. Now as they got near the house, they heard moaning and wailing of people mourning this dead girl. But Jesus went straight into the house and said, Why are you crying? She's not dead. She's just asleep. <laughs> now all the people in the house knew that she really was dead. So they started making fun of Jesus. But he forced them all out of the house. And Jesus and his three apprentices, along with Jairus and his wife, went into the room where the girl was lying. Jesus took her by the hand and said to her, Little one, get up. And the girl got up and started walking around and Jairus and his wife were just overcome with emotion at what they'd just seen. And Jesus said to them, Make sure she has something to eat. But I don't want you to tell anyone what's happened here today yet. 